slow traffic. What was your, what, what environment were you in that was the happiest? What place in the world since now you've been out of country a few times? Oh, um, Deep Creek. Well, that wasn't <laughs> my. Are you just meeting even temporary? Uh huh. You, just, you know, use your imagination. Like you just could be there as long as you want. Okay, no, that's a really good question. I'm definitely losing my voice a little bit. That's a good question. I'm going to say Deep Creek would be good. That would be up there. I like that trip. Uh, Thailand was up there. The Wee Spa is up there. Mm. You have to do that. Uh, It'll be much more enjoyable with someone else there, you know. It was just like, yeah, it's a that's more of solo, a. But yeah, it would be nice to have friends too. Yeah, camaraderie thing. Yeah. Um, but I know it's cliche, but I to go to go back to it. Just like in my apartment when we were just hanging out watching movies, that was like I would yeah. put that up there, and uh, because it was. I only wish, like, there was more window, like, in there, there's another window, you know? So that was kind of, like, blocked off that area where then we did the movies. Yeah. Otherwise, that was very comfortable. Yeah, and so, but it was more than just that, like, there was just more to it because it was, there's something, there's just something different about than the normal, because I've watched movies with people a lot, but th those times, like, it was one of the few times I would, like, look forward to coming Stop home and work. go traffic. It was relaxed. It was felt like home. Yeah, is what you can say. Yeah, it's a hard feeling for me to find. Yeah, it was like that. It just that's the song when I go somewhere. It's like it never lasts. It never doesn't last very long. Like it's you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that would be one. Uh, I don't think I'll put my suggestion. Well, well, what's the best one besides the movies? And what was in, what's the? Because that's uh, like four different ones. Oh, well, there's gotta be there's gotta be one that's like super. You know, I, I forgot the question at this point. Hmm. Oh, happy. I, I thought it was just your favorite, my favorite places. But okay. It made you most happy. The most happy. Or comfortable, on, I guess. You know, I can't even think of. I can't think of any except for when she was visiting or when I was in love, you know. Um, oh, okay, that's the one I was visiting my girlfriend, was that? Hmm. Definitely want a more calm relationship. I mean, visiting my girlfriend is up there, but it has more to do with her than the environment. Spa is going to be definitely in my top 10, and it could be in my top 5. Deep Creek also could be up there too. I wish that wasn't so far. I would go there. And so difficult to get to. And not be summer anymore now. Uh, it takes a few months. You can still go there. It's just... Uh, I need to figure out what... Stop and go traffic. What vehicle I'm going to travel in because... If I get famous really fast, if I'm in a location, people are going to, like, track me down. Like, I'm going to have to be on the move. Yeah. Yeah. Paparazzi and stuff. They're your biggest fan. They'll follow you until you love them. <laughs> yeah. And that's not... These, these poor famous people, that's not a realistic scenario. Like, that's why they date other famous people most of the time, right? Oh, definitely. How are you going to get to know a fan, like, in a, in a context yeah. without this, like, baggage, like... Yeah. Where it's like, what do they like you for, and how do you even get to know them without the, you know, without the things like, in the way? This girl, if I was ar already like rich, and famous in the music world or something, mm -hmm. I I don't know what I could do with her. Like, because I mean, what? I trust I could trust her 
sincerity now because I'm broke. Oh yeah. But if she, if I met her with all that I would hope to have at some point, that would be a tough day. Mm. Even just friendships, I would be cynical about, or not cynical is not the right word. Um, suspicious or. That's a cross. What question? It was a good question. The best place is where is the happiest. Yeah, it's taking me to great contemplating. Um, I really did like Thailand. Um, yeah, that's that's the thing where I feel like I recently, like being a man, is you have the power, you have the strength to conquer, you know, as much as you can, and you you know gather these resources and stuff, and then you're supposed to be a provider. So balance that with. Wanting to wanting someone to love you for who you are and not what you have, so yeah. it's this weird bipolar shit. So I, it's like, eh. Hmm. So I guess you gotta have both, you know. You got at one time you gotta compromise and say, I guess gotta gotta go with what I, what's in front of me. Um, I can't. I'm not gonna make myself poor just to make sure that she doesn't like me for the money, you know. That's why you have the values, and you make sure you have the same kind of values, you know. Which I'm, right now I'm talking about anti-divorce values. So uh, mm. commitment, ability to commit. You know, for, well, life, for a life. Obviously, those are my values. For a lifetime, through um, sickness and in health, for richer, for poorer. 